Hi, my name's Sean Cummins. I work for Balfour PT on the Northwest GDSP. When we arrived on site, we identified 12 properties, all people vulnerable with all independent different needs. We had to find a solution to work with each one, their carers, to make it all work on the one day to replace the gas mains. We just wanted to get the job done as quickly and as efficiently as possible, causing the least amount of disruption. I support a gentleman who um, lives on this estate, a deafblind gentleman with him living independently as well with support. He will do his daily routines that he knows himself, but anything out of the ordinary, any works or any say, for example, when the workmen had to be around the back in the garden, he didn't need to know they were there. So if he went out, it wouldn't alarm him and it wouldn't like frighten him. Sean was yeah amazing. He kept us in the loop and he was literally went above and beyond because nothing was too much trouble for them at all. First of all, he showed me the gentleman's garden next door so we could see what was going to happen, so I can explain that to the client to reassure him. And then when the hole was in the client's garden, he covered it up to make sure that it was safe and then the barriers were put round to, again, another safety measure and then sandbags. It was just really important that he was kept safe, but yeah, Sean just made sure that everything ran smoothly because it really was like a complex situation. Well, they come out and said they were putting new gas pipes in and they said they were really apologetic because they said they might have to dig my patio up, but they managed to do it without it. Left a massive big hole by my back door, really, really big one, which if the dog had fallen in, he'd have been buried all weekend, but they fixed that for me. They were even brilliant with the dog, let the dog help them. Didn't have to keep him out the way and they, they moved me meter, my gas meter, from under the sink, which was brilliant. I didn't have to bend down on my knees anymore and put it on the back for me. The ward means a lot uh, to me, personally, but also um, I feel in a way I don't really deserve it in the fact that I do this on a day-to-day -day basis. I just treat people how I'd like to be treated myself, my brother, my sister, my mother, grandmother, any other member of my family, and the way I'd like them to be treated. I happened to mention to Sean that my bolt on the gate was a bit knackered. Oh, give us a screwdriver, I'll fix it for you. And it was brilliant for a couple of months, but I think the wind's blowing the post out the way now, so it's all mucked up again. I'll have to give him another shout <laughs> so he can come back and fix it again for me. <laughs>